Hello, this is a demo of hot tea, my hot chai for Java coffee um, class reloading library. Basically, if you want to use Java in a way similar to some of the scripting languages that are popular now, um, you have a couple of options for not having to constantly restart. One is using a JVM agent um, that a number of projects use that can redefine classes that are loaded in the JVM. Another approach is to use a custom class loader and keep reloading classes and their dependencies as they change. Hot is based on the latter approach. Here's a quick demo of how I can do this. This is a very, very simple swing application just to illustrate the idea. Uh, I'm not entirely sure if the threading, um, swing rated threading is done right here, but that's not the point. Essentially, I've got a main here. Um, I take two arguments. Uh, one is a directory and one is an implementation class name. I then run this example in the run method. What we do here is that we use the usual swing utilities invoke later. Um, we give this a minute so that the create show UI method here, which creates a new swing J frame is opened. We then use the hot class loader builder, which is the hot tier utility to add a class path entry for the plugin classes based here. And we say add listeners this and build this. By add listener this, we can see that this example main class here implements listener. Listener is an interface that has an on reload method that gives us a class loader. This gets called every time any file under our plugin classes base directory changes. So what we can do here is we can instantiate a drawer class. We have a small interface here. Um, just for the purpose of examples, draw or draw, draw something on a JFrame, create a new instance of it, we'll remove the previous content of the JFrame and draw on it. Let's see how this looks like. If I start this up, and I have a launch config in Eclipse with two parameters, I get a hello world here. This hello world is nowhere in here. It comes from the class I've called here. Let me show you my launch config. Uh, this is called with a directory workspace example swing target classes and with a hot t example swing one example swing drawer class this example swing drawer class is over here so there's actually two projects which is important for this you don't want the uh, plugin or module or whatever uh, class to be loaded by your primary class loader this class here implements this little drawer interface and it is the one that says drawer hello world now let's check this out. What if we change this, save this class? Whoa, pretty cool, right? It actually hot reloads this drawer and redraws. Now, something similar could be achieved with other approaches. What's cool in this is that you're not limited by um, hot reloading limitations, like the JVM standard debug hot reload or these different um, Java agents that are available. I've listed them all in the readme of this project on GitHub. But basically here you can do all sorts of refactorings. Um, something like this obviously works without a problem, which I think some of the agents also support. Extract method, say like text or something like this. And then say um, something like this. This also works. Um, but we could even implement other interfaces and things like this, which I think some of the agents don't support that well. That still works. We can add other um, classes. Um, for example, I could go into a, uh, whatever. This is just an example. It doesn't make sense to have this serializable, but I can create a second class here um, and delegate to another class. And I can basically do free Java programming um, without any limitations and have this class here hot reloaded. Note that this class here, which is on the main class path, I can't change. So if I would do something like this here, this doesn't do anything because the logic of hot reloading is on the class path of this project here. The idea is to use this library hot tia, um, which has this hot class loader builder as the main entry point for things like um, perhaps plugins for for systems like maybe games. Um, you could use this to build something like a business application where you have some rules coded in Java that you want to reload on changes. Essentially anything where you have small bits of code that extend larger always up running applications. Games, game loops are a good example. Um, 
I think this is cool and interesting. Mm, small side effect, something I built as part of this that is not related to hot reloading itself is a small watch directory example, which is this one here, that might be of interest to you in its own right. Thanks for watching. Hot Tia, check out the project in GitHub. Bye.